So, good morning class. So, we have a problem here for problem number one for day four. So, we have a problem three. Quantity 3x squared plus y squared dx minus 2xy dy. So, first step is to find out if this problem is a homogeneous. So, this term, uh, sec second degree, this term, second degree, and this term is second degree. So, it is a homogeneous. And this M, so this is, remember this is M and N. Function of X and Y, function of X and Y. M and N as a function of X and Y. So this is a homogeneous. You can solve this by homogeneous. So in our previous discussion in day 3, we saw a variable separable. So let's find out if this if we can solve this by variable separable. So dx is a function of x and y. So we cannot group dx. We cannot group the value all the value of x and dx. And we cannot group the value of y and dy. So, this problem can only be solved by homogeneous. So, let's check this. We can solve this by homogeneous. It's not a separable. So, so this, if, if, so this term is simpler. So, dy use, so this is dy use y is equal to bx that's how I memorize the homogeneous so this term is simpler y is equal to bx so that dy is equal to bdx plus x db so so the next step is to substitute y is equal to bx substitute it here and here Substitute y, substitute y, substitute y, and dy. So the arriving equation is 3, 3, 3 quantity, 3x three squared plus, so y squared is equals to b squared plus x squared. So x squared, b squared plus x squared dx minus, so 2x times bx. So y is bx, it's equal to 2x squared b, and dy, so dy, dy, equals to b dx plus x db. So, as you can see, x, x squared is common in each term. So we can cancel, uh, cancel that out. So we can simplify that. So, so x squared is common, so I will put one or I will multiply by one over x squared. So the arriving equation is three quantity three plus b squared. So this is cancel, this is cancel. So three plus b x squared, uh, b squared dx minus. So x squared divide x squared so 2b plus b dx plus x db. So applying mat mathematically, so distribute it, just multiply this to this term 9 9dx plus table squared dx minus so distributively multiply. Minus 2b squared dx minus 2bx dx.
then as you can see so it is this and this is common so we can subtract that so the Rami equation is 9 dx plus b, b squared dx so minus 2 bx db so so we have now uh, wait. so okay so as you notice this is common so we can take that out so quantity 9 plus b squared dx minus 2 bx db so as you can see we have now a homogeneous, a uh, separable, variable separable. So from homogeneous, we are up to variable separable. So, private class of variable separable. So, I want to remove this 9b squared db, so I'll put it here. And x, I want to remove x in db, so... 1 over 9 plus b squared x multiply that to this equation. So we have now dx over x minus 2b db plus 9b squared. So we have now a variable separable. So we will now, after we are at variable separable, we will now integrate. So process of integration. So what? What are the things that comes in my mind if I see uh, integration? First is, uh, so this is a basic integration. dx over x. Well, this, so uh, basic integration. We cannot simplify. We cannot simplify. So let's, so this is x. We cannot do that. So u sub. Remember in u substitution, this is always the binomial is always the u so let u is equal to 9 plus b squared so that du is equal to 2 b db so this is 2 b db so this is the u so we have now so this dx over x minus du over u is equal to 0 so the Rami equation is ln x minus ln u is equal to ln c. So, ln x minus ln 9 plus b squared. So, 9 plus b squared is this is the u. It's equal to ln c. So, law of uh, logarithmic. Uh, so, this part, I shortcut this. Well, we have now x over 9 plus b squared is equal to c. Remember that b squared comes from this. So, equating for v, so b is equal to y over x. So, we have now x is equal to 9 plus y over x squared. equal to C. So, simplifying, we have x over 9 plus y squared over x squared is equal to C. So remember that. We have now x, so law of fraction, 9x squared plus y squared over x squared is equal to c. So we can transpose this, and transpose this, it will become x is equal to Nine x squared plus y squared. 
over x squared times c. So we can simplify this. It will become x cubed is equal to c times 9x squared plus y squared. So this is the final answer. For number one.